beautiful people hello and welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing my lash collection so i've just took this out of my set of drawers these drawers by the way in case you are wondering are from ikea and um, it's just their metal drawer so you can take them fully out really really good to kind of clean down i mean it's a little bit mucky there but they're really easy to, to clean down and stuff as well so this one just has all of my lashes in i've managed to cram this into this drawer instead of it being in like my big fat drawers that i used to have before well i've still got them but i just don't use them for my lashes anymore um, so let's just get straight into it. As you can probably tell, I have a lot of doll lashes. Doll lashes are probably my favourite lashes ever. So I've turned you to the side and I think the best way for me to do it is to just lift up the lashes and show you them kind of basically a one by one. So first up is these doll dreamer ones from Doll Beauty. Um, these ones are in the... Oh god, this camera is doing my head in. Um, these ones are in the um, style Sandy. So these ones are in the um, style Eva. Eva are the, the lashes to go for if you want some drama llama in your life. Eva is like my go-to need to make an impact kind of lash these ones definitely need a good clean because as you can see um, on the corner here from where i've like probably fell asleep wearing them after a night out and um, they've got a little bit bent so i need to sort that out but these are in the shade chloe elizabeth chloe elizabeth and eva uh, and olivia are probably my favorite lashes from doll beauty Um i love olivia for more natural kind of glam and um, either for the full-on drama and i love chloe elizabeth if you've done a really nice kind of eye look or you just want um your eyes to kind of pop or um your eyes should pop because it has like the little gaps um in between it but it's not doesn't look gappy but it just makes you like your obviously eyeshadow and stuff shines through this one is in the shade kimberly it focuses there we go some of these will definitely need washing because I'm really bad at, at washing them. These ones are in the shade, um, shade, and these are Love Lace. We also have the style Lanny. These ones are Stephanie, so these ones are a lot more natural, not as thick and full as the other ones. Then we have Chloe. Chloe is probably a less dramatic version of the Chloe Elizabeth ones. These ones are Frankie. Then we've got Jerry, Arabella really really pretty i need to start using because some of these i haven't even actually used once i need to start using um lashes more to be fair obviously i've got my individual ones on at the moment um but i'll be getting these took off within the next week or so so i can start doing some um like tutorials and stuff for years these are the ones in olivia so these ones that i was on about where it's good for like natural just soft glam olivia is beautiful olivia is also my middle name in case you just didn't know that <laughs> and we also have aurora Ariel. We have another pair of Eva because clearly they're my favourite. <laughs> we have Brandy which you can see has some lovely glittery purpley eyeshadow stuck to it. Lush. Needs a good clean. Another one of them Lovelace. I think I've got quite a few of them Lovelace because they're meant to be it's basically in top shop they have like different names to the ones that they do on the website so they're meant to be like the Chloe Elizabeth ones but they aren't as full as the Chloe Elizabeth ones. Um, we have Elsa which is really, really nice and natural. Another pair of Chloe Elizabeth, I think this one has. Yeah, it's got some glitter on there, so they clearly need a clean as well. <laughs> Another one of the Doll Dreamer ones. These are um, the Bambi ones. I don't really know when I'd use them, to be fair. <laughs> um, but yeah. We have, next up we have Divine. Ginger. Another pair of Chloe's uh, Chloe's Elizabeth. <laughs> Another pair of Chloe Elizabeth, as you can tell, I absolutely love this. And it's got glitter on it, so they clearly need a wash. Clearly what I must do is instead of washing them, I just open a new pack. Because <laughs> I'm just like that. <laughs> these are Selena, which I don't think I've used. Quite a lot of these I haven't actually got around to using, to be honest. If it focuses, that'd be lovely jubbly. Thank you. Then we have the style Bex. Brooke. Brooke looks really long, doesn't she? <laughs> Jasmine, which is meant to be a really, really um, thick, like a dramatic one, a bit like Eva, but obviously that looks a little bit longer and not as full as Eva. And then speaking of Eva, these are another pair of Eva. <laughs> so down this little middle bit here, we have a couple of just like random ones. So we have this one pair from Funky Lash. I'm not actually too sure what the style is for them. Doesn't actually say. Um, this one, oh God, that just fell out. This is from the brand False Eyelashes. They also do different brands, but obviously they have their own branding as well. I think this is another, yeah, another one from them too. 
Okay, so I've changed my camera setting, so hopefully it'll focus a little bit better this time. Um, down the side here, I have all of my unicorn lashes. So I've got quite a few of these. I ended up buying like a bundle of them. I've <laughs> I've ripped basically the top of it off because it just took up so much room. Um, so yeah, they don't look the best, but it's just so that they actually fit into this drawer. So these are the um, style Stormy. We also have these ones. These are Majestic Air. As you can see, I've wore these ones as well, and they need a clean. Kind of a bit of a common theme here. <laughs> then we have these ones, which are Peachy Pie. I've not actually wore these ones yet, but these ones look beautiful. Then we have these ones, which you can tell I've definitely used because they look a bit icky, but also I've cut them down so they actually fit my eye a bit better. Um, and these are in the um, Apple Sours design. And then last but not least, for Unicorn Lashes, we have Lemon Meringue, um, which I think... Yeah, I've worn this one as well. Um, I'm pretty sure Lemon Meringue is what Amber's favourite ones are, but I actually can't remember. Um, so that's on my Unicorn Cosmetic Lashes. The rest are kind of just like random ones. Um, so we have some like Ardell Wispies. We've got just some individual ones just off eBay. Just little cheap ones. Um, we've got a couple of Doll Beauty kind of packs. So we have this one here. Um, which has the lashes, lower lashes, and then um, like little festival hearts. We have, oh, these are all going to fall, aren't they? I'm going to have to just, I'm not even bothered anymore. I'll sort it out afterwards. Um, we've got this stack. I'm not actually sure what these are called, but it's just one of their stack lashes. And there's another one. They have all, they look like they're all the same. No, they're all different, actually. What else have we got? Oh, this is from Kiss. So this has some lashes, some tweezers, some glue, some scissors, and then a little thing to measure it as well. I might actually... Oh, no, I won't be able to send it, will I? Can I send trip, um, scissors? Oh, I, won't, I won't risk it. I was going to say I might put, I'll put that into my giveaway pal, but I'm not sure what the rules are regarding sending like scissors and stuff in packages like worldwide so I just won't risk it just in case Um, we've got some cheap ones from eBay again some more Ardell ones, Ardell ones I'm not really that bothered about and um, these are the Mega Volume 250s and um, we have one from NEMUA Mink Lashes, these are in the um, Style 6, I actually really like them ones Um, it's like a, they have like an Instagram and stuff but it's like a local um kind of business name me and we have quite a few of the Lash Unlimited ones um, so I'm just going to show you what these ones look like. I don't know if I've used many of these to be fair. I only normally use lashes when I go on a night out. So it's really rare that I actually have a chance to play around with them. But I'm definitely going to start using them more in makeup tutorials just to get some news out of them and see which ones I prefer and just so that I can recommend some to use as well. Apart from like my typical three that I like to use from Doll Beauty. There's them ones. Back here, we have some Kiss lashes. So we have some of their Blooming lashes. So this one is in Peony. We also have Daisy. These are a lot more natural. Um, another Peony, I think probably another, yeah, another Peony as well. To be fair, these ones um, were kind of given to me, but the typically ones that I actually give to my best friend Laura for nights out and stuff because she... Um, always forget to buy lashes so I typically give her the kiss ones because they're not as crazy and in the face as some of my other lashes um, as well so we have just another one from eBay just a cheap one and um, really nice and full we've got some in here that I've kept the box for just so I knew what they were but I, I don't know how but I've managed to bin the packaging on the inside so that's that's kind of the lashes there these are from um, XO Beauty the Rebel lashes which I'm not going to lie, I actually really like. Um, these ones are bougie as. These are my Lily Lashes um, in yeah, Mykonos. One of like the most popular ones. This is from XO Beauty again, but this is more of their like mink lashes. These ones are a lot better quality um, than the other ones, but I do, I do really like them. I've never actually wore these ones, but they are really full. Really, really full. <laughs> And um, we've got a couple from this brand called El Eldora. I think that's what how you pronounce it. So we have the M one one twos. We have the H one six sevens, and then we also have the M 
108 as well. I think this is just some more, yeah, just some more individual ones. I think these are Technic ones. I just remember ripping the top off just so it fit in that little gap. Um, and then the last ones that we have, I don't actually think this company exists anymore. And um, these are the Dirty Doll Lashes. So there's loads of different ones inside. I'm not going to open them all up because, like I said, I don't think um, they, they actually, what's the word? Um, I don't think they're actually a company anymore. I'm sure that they're the close the business so i won't even bother showing you them ones because obviously you can't be buying them because you just can't so a little side note before i finish off um this video i'm just putting things back and trying to squish it back in how i had them organized beforehand um for these ones because i have three of the peony ones i'm actually going to take two out of the peony style um to put into basically <laughs> excuse my room um basically these um kind of containers that i've got here one of them has like i don't know just rubbish in like stuff that i need to start doing videos on and all that kind of stuff um and then the other one has stuff for giveaways in it so i'm gonna put these two into my giveaway um like a giveaway pile for future giveaways so it won't be in next month's giveaway that's coming up on wednesday next week because um i've already filmed it <laughs> i've already filmed it and already picked the prizes for that as well but um yeah because we went to put that kiss set in but obviously I, I don't know if i can with it having the scissors in it um so at least i can put the um kiss lashes in instead and at least i've still got two for laura um as well i think if i've got any of these dirty doll ones i think i might put some of these dirty doll ones in as well if, if there's some that i haven't actually used like so them ones haven't been used so just double check yeah so i'll put them in my giveaway pile as well just so that i've not got as many basically in this drawer oh hello there's my foot um i think i've used them ones from the looks of it um yeah these ones are brand new as well so i'm going to put them into my giveaway pile and i think the other two i've used yeah, they're definitely being used. Um, so yeah, I think I'll put them into my giveaway pile as well. And it just kind of puts it down a little bit so that there's some more stuff in there for you guys to keep it like kind of topped up. Um, I think I'm going to put some of these Lash Unlimited ones in as well. So I'll put them ones in. I like the look of them ones. Um, I'll put them ones in because I probably wouldn't really reach for them. I've already wore them ones, haven't I? Yeah, can't give me them ones. Um, I'm going to keep, do I want to keep them? No, let's just stop being greedy, Lucy. They can go in there as well. Keep them ones, keep them ones. I think the rest, oh, there's some more lash ones over here. I think I've used them ones. Have I? Yeah, I think I have. Right, let's keep them ones, because obviously I have to do some videos on them, because the brand did send me them. Um, but obviously I'll put some into giveaways for use. I think everything else um, I want to keep or I've already used ones <laughs> and dibbled and dabbled. Let's have a look at these ones. Um, I'm going to put these ones in uh, my giveaway pile, H167s. I'm going to keep the M1, yeah I'll keep them too because I would actually reach for them as well. So let's put them ones back in here as well. Yes, yeah, so at least we've got this little pile of lashes to put into my giveaway tub as well. Basically, say thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to finish off um, organising this. Obviously, when we get rid of a couple as well, I might organise it a little bit different. But say thank you so much for watching, and I'll hopefully see you tomorrow for a brand new video. It's going to be my monthly favourites. Um, and then after that, I'll be back on Wednesday for a huge giveaway again. Um, and I'll be back uploading on Wednesdays, Fridays and Sundays at 6 o'clock UK time. Um, thank you so much. I love you so much. Goodbye. Mm.